Mr. Beagley. Hey there guys and gals, it's Gerbeagly with another episode of Gaming with Gerbeagly and I'm once again playing another random one shot from over here on lag.com. This is a game called Roll This Ball and in this what we have is a ball that's in this weird shape on the right here and we have to move other puzzle pieces so that the ball has a clear path to the goal and it will eventually just move itself once we've uh, completed that puzzle. So let's go ahead, let's see what this is all about in action. It looks really cool, it sounds very relaxing just from that menu screen music. So we just pull that down. Oh, I like that, that's nice and simplistic. Ooh, all right, three stars, the first go. So we have a target number of moves. And then we have to try to get the ball to the goal by then. Oh, cool. Awesome. I like this type of game. This is really fun. This is very cool. I'm assuming that like 240 at the beginning was probably the goal uh, of stars. Like if you get three stars on every single level. Oh, yeah. Getting all those stars. We're going to be there in no time. This is awesome. So this one is going to be a little bit more complicated because we need that and then that and then that wasn't more complicated. It just takes thinking ahead a little bit. If you think ahead a little bit, you can figure these out like pretty easily, which is nice. So this one, we can probably do this, 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 this. Boom. All done. All taken care of. All pretty simple. Nice. Okay, I love games like this because they are fairly relaxing, but they are still very, very challenging. Uh, okay, so this time what we want to do is we want to probably... We got to move this so that it goes here. Oh, that was way too many moves, though. Like, we completed the path, but I think we can... Uh, I mean, I know... We can make this not take that many moves. We can definitely make this take not that many moves. So maybe this, there we go. Just make those two shuffle by each other and then the block with no pipes in it. It just, we'll leave that one alone pretty much. Okay, so here we need to get this all the way down. So that will be hooked up and then boom, 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 and then eight. Yeah, it's the goal, there's the path. It's all completed. That ball rolling through those pipes. Nice and easy. Nice and quick. Okay, so this one. This one a little bit more complicated from the looks, maybe. Oh, no, it's not. Boom. There it is. Lock it in there. So some of the pieces you don't even use, and those are like your red herring pieces. Those are the types of pieces that are going to mess us up. And then it looks like some of these blocks are bolted down where you can't even move them. So that we, we have to compete with that as well, which is difficult. So something else to keep in mind, something else that's going to make things a lot harder. So here, let's do... Okay, uh, I think I already messed up. Yeah, I definitely messed up. Let's restart it. Let's uh, really think about this one. So this time, let's maybe move that. And then we really have to get this piece that is sort of like the L shape. We have to get that down towards the oh man how are we gonna do that uh we have to get that down here but how do we do all that how do we do everything that i just did there but in only 10 moves how do you do that in 10 moves this is gonna be really complicated i feel like uh so we could move that again there like i said before we could move that again there uh we could move um hmm i think the pieces over on the right are maybe false they're they're trying to mislead me oh i think i might have figured it out right yeah there we go it's all about the shuffle you just shuffle it around and then eventually you find the answer that's all it is it just takes a little bit of like i said thinking ahead but at the same time it it's not as complicated as you think it's going to be sometimes which is good so here i think this is nine moves so boom 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 and then boom, 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 boom. There's nine. That's easy. Very, very good. And we get that every single time. I just noticed also that some of these have little key symbols in them. Or, oh, wait, no, magnifying glass symbols in them. And those are hints. So if I get really stuck, if I get super stumped because of puzzle, I can just use the magnifying glass and I'm able to get a hint. Because some of those 
with all the different pieces that you don't actually use, those are going to get very, very complicated. Those are going to get very misleading. They're going to get very annoying. They're going to just be the type of puzzle that will make me want to tear my hair out or something like that. So uh, instead of doing that, I think it will be better. Oh, man, we used way too many moves there. I think it will be a lot better if we're able to just, uh, I guess, uh, I guess just, uh, yeah, there we go. Uh, <laughs> have those available. That's all I was trying to say. Sorry, I'm so concentrated. I like you guys know that I love games like this. And when it comes to a puzzle game, that's a good challenge. I get hyper focused and I just want to beat it. So I, whatever I'm saying at the time might go through my brain, out my mouth, without actually making any sort of sense. So, <laughs> that's what you guys gotta deal with. I'm so sorry. Um, but, yeah, like I was trying to say there, uh, there is... Oh man, we used way too many moves again. And now we can't, even, we can't even do it that way. I don't even think that's even possible that way. But yeah, instead of driving ourselves crazy, we're going to make sure that we actually use the hints if we really, really need one. In fact, what I'm going to do, guys, and I noticed there's a timer above the hints as well. So I'm guessing that the 6 out of 10 means that those recharge over time or something along, along those lines. Or maybe that's how much time it takes before you can find another one. I'm going to use one right now. I want to find out. Oh, oh, does this give me this gives me the full solution? Oh, look at that. That would have been incredibly complicated. I won't even lie, but there it is. There you have it. That is actually giving us a full solution for that puzzle. That is one that might have taken me a little bit of time, a few extra tries. Because like ones like that, those ones are so freaking simple. Those ones are easy peasy to me. Those ones I can do in my sleep. But th that one, that, that last one, before this one was a little bit crazy. Oh, I see what, I think I see what I need to do already. So here we go. Don't despair me. Yeah, there we go. Level 16 complete. I don't know how many levels there are in this, but it looks like we're cruising through this pretty quick here. Uh, it feels good. I won't lie. I feel challenged, like I said before, but I don't feel so challenged that I'm gonna like lose my mind over this. Oh, jeez. All right. But if I could rotate pieces correctly, that'd also be good. Um, nope, that's not what I want to do. I almost had it. I was so close to having it. Um, okay, so bada bing, bada not that. Um, bop, bop, bop. Oh, like that? Is that all I have to do? Oh, can I do that a lot quicker by maybe doing that there it is he, sometimes you'll find the right order of pieces but you won't move them in the right order and sometimes just reversing the order that you move them in is enough to actually be able to find the solution that's a neat little trick there that you guys can try out if you so need one there we go boom there we go i like the patterns that these pathways make as well it's really cool looking. Like I said, there's like this sense of rewarding, I don't know, whatever, <laughs> playing this, which uh, makes it really great. So, okay, almost two off that time. So that's the pathway we need to use. And those, those look like uh, it's gonna be every block being used. Um, it definitely looks like every single block is gonna be used. So maybe do this here. Uh-huh, boom. Oh no, still 12, okay. So how do I do that a little bit easier? Level 19, you stumped me twice now. Stumped me twice, okay. Boom, oh, here we go. I just, I was just adding extra steps without needing to. That way was a lot more streamlined. That was a lot quicker that way. All right, cool. So I am figuring it out. I really am figuring it out. Uh, all right, so this one we might need to well, first, let's see what it needs for a solution. What is this? What's what's it going to take to get that ball over to where it needs to go? Is it going to be? It's going to be that. Is that really the goal? Because that's going to take some real crazy messing around there. <laughs> I won't lie. I feel like this is going to be a little bit complicated. Maybe not. Okay. Oh, no, I messed it up. I probably could have done it with the other uh, straight up and down piece. Okay. Still got a better score than last time. Didn't get more uh, stars, but this time around, we're going to get those things. Ah, oh, darn it. This game, 
man oh man oh man talk about a challenge so move those out of the way there and then use this one instead and oh target nine though and i did it in ten oh how do i how do i do it guys oh how do i do it now it's like now it's really getting me now it's getting me because i know what i need to do that's 10 again I know what I need to do, kind of, but I don't 100% know what I need to do. What if I move that down there first and then move that up? There it is. Okay, so it was the left vertical piece that we needed to use. Boom. All right. So that was level 20, guys. That one was very challenging, very complicated. So we got a total of 60 stars out of the 240 available. I'm not going to ruin the surprises that are in store for you guys. Definitely give this a look. This is a fun, like I said, very relaxing puzzle game because there's no time limit or anything like that. You just got to figure out the best solution. And even if you figure out a solution that doesn't meet the target number of moves, you can still move on to the next level. It's not like you lose the game or anything like that. But you guys also know me. I need those triple stars for every single level that I play. But anyway... This was super fun. Hopefully you guys had fun watching this as well. If you did, please, please, please check this game out over here on lag.com. And as always, it was great seeing you. Bye-bye.